Ellis James and John Robbins. Radio X. Something has changed on the airwaves, folks, because it's time for Ellis and John on Radio X, or as the Romans would have called it, Radio 10. <laughs> I am John Robbins, and to my left is officially Wales's 36th coolest man, according to walesonline.co.uk, <laughs> Mr Ellis James. Good morning, John. How are you doing, man? I'm all right, yeah. Um, Wales Online is the website for the Western Mail newspaper. And, uh, yeah, you're, I mean, it's going to sound like a lie, but according to them, I am the 36th coolest living Welsh man. It's true. What does it feel like to pip Owen Wynne Evans <laughs> to 36th spot? Just really... Who they list as a weather presenter and cat lover. <laughs> <laughs> What's it like to be cooler than Owen Wynne Evans? <laughs> Just really... I finally feel vindicated. I mean, that's always what I wanted. I've had my eye on a wine win Evans for a long time, actually. So to pip him at this late stage feels really, really sweet. I mean, he sounds so cool. <laughs> to quote from the Wales Online website, he's a familiar face with a young Welsh audience after presenting BBC Wales' children's news programme, <laughs> File, straight out of school. Now he's letting us know whether it's going to rain or not, as he does the <laughs> forecast on BBC Wales Today and Radio Wales. He's also a talented drummer with a soft spot for all things feline. <laughs> I mean, how can you be cooler than him? He's a talented drummer, he's got a soft spot for all things feline, and he presents the news. And then we scroll down yeah. to the, the coveted 36th spot. <clears throat> it's Mr Ellis James. Yeah. He made oh. producers turn his character in sitcom Josh into a Wales fan so he could wear, and extend, his collection of rare <laughs> retro Welsh football tops. Oh! Cool or what? Wow. wow, what a cool thing to do. <laughs> Plus, he did the first stand-ups in Welsh language. What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. It's and became true. a dad not true. with partner Issy. Yeah, they spelled spell that yeah. wrong. Of peep show fame. Yes, wow, and then... Right. Oh, to be beaten by Matt Johnson, TV oh, the... presenter for Good Morning Britain. Oh, no. They've got a photo of him tucking into a, an omelette. <laughs> <laughs> we like a guy who doesn't take himself too seriously, <laughs> and Carefilly's Matt certainly doesn't do that. In incidentally, the photo they've used of me is one I absolutely loathe. Oh, it looks like... Either you are puffy from drugs, uh, <laughs> or I'm puffy from I'm puffy from real ale. I'm puffy from Doom Bar. It you was... know what? You uh. know that thing Vic Reeves used to do, where they would <laughs> fold newspapers over on people's <laughs> eyes yeah, to make their faces look small. It looks <laughs> <like that. laughs> basically. It's an awful photo. It was taken. I was doing a Radio Wales program just before we went on. They said we need a photo of the eye player, and I said right, and they just took it, and I said, well, you're not using that, and they said it's going to have to do, and it has been used about five thousand times on. Vic various newspapers, websites and things. And it, it was basically, to contextualising it, it was, it was around 2010, it was during my Doombar lost weekend when I thought I didn't <laughs> have to exercise, I could eat what I wanted, I could drink as much real ale as I wanted to. I thought I could be the man who had it all. You look like you're taking part in a retrospective about what went wrong with Ocean <laughs> Colour Scene. <laughs> I'm probably, I'm probably, I'm probably a stone and a half heavier than I am now, actually. Yeah, and I'm, it's all in your jaw. <laughs> I was going to say, it doesn't explain why your lips look a little bit higher up on your chin yeah, than they I, do now. Yeah, very really high. Doombar distorted my face. Yeah. You've, I, they've, it's like all your features have been photoshopped into, sort of like, they've been sucked into the middle. Yes, <laughs> right. John. It's the worst thing I've ever seen. Yes, okay. I hate it. It's it makes me just sick. Just because you're hungover doesn't mean you've got to take it out on, a, on an image mouth. of my face. <laughs> Shut your tiny high mouth. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to tweet it, obviously. Yeah, we're yeah. going to tweet it every hour oh, on the hour Vin's, for the next year. Vin's given the thumbs up, so I'm assuming it's been done. Well, hey. See, I'm such a, a, a laid-back cool guy that I don't mind flooding Google with that image again. Ellis, you're laid-back like all high-mouthed men. <laughs> You can't be uptight if you've got a high mouth and a wide, fat jaw, like you do in this picture. It's the sort of picture that your mum would look at and go, I think you look lovely. Yes. It doesn't, it's not like you're not gurning My mum, my mum saw the photo and, well, she, she texted me the, a link to the, um, to, to the article and I said, oh, I hate that photo, mum. And she said, you just look so pleased to be 36th on the list. <laughs> And I thought, yeah, I look like the cat that drank far too much cream. <laughs> I like the fact that number 34 
is um, so so Ellis is also cooler according to this list than Reese E fans. Am I? And um, I'm the, the Manic Street Preachers. Am I? Yeah. yeah. But thirty four. They've put the stereophonics, but it's only Kelly Jones and Richard Jones. <laughs> so they've got a photo of all four stereophonics. Yeah. But number 34 is Kelly Jones right <laughs> and Richard Jones second left. Yes. What about the other two phonics? Well, they're not Welsh. Uh, they're sort of session musicians, aren't they? Are they? No, they are in the band. But well, think... yeah, but then they're not original members no. of the band. Are no. they not? No. no. What, no who no, are the no. original members? What well, Stuart, Stuart Cable, who died a few years ago, oh, and then... Don't the, dare. The, the, <laughs> Sorry. The, the other one is just a, se a second guitarist, I think. Oh, yeah. my lord. How did he die? Um, I'm not sure. Yeah. Let's not discuss that now. I can't remember, but either way, it obviously, it was very sad. And yeah. that is why... Sorry, Hysteriophonics. Well, but I think maybe they should have included, just said the stereophonics. Yeah, yes, it is It is slightly strange that they've picked out two of the stereophonics, because, I mean, that's going to make the dynamic at rehearsals a bit weird, isn't it? Well, well, actually, I'm coming in. Ones walk in. I see, uh, I see Wales Online, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so you got in there, Kelly, and you, Richard? Where were you on the list? Oh, just, um, let's, let's just start practising, shall we, for God's sake. <laughs> Apparently playing the bass guitar doesn't get you on the list. Yeah. <laughs> Who's that fat bloke in a number 36, the one with a tiny high mouth? <laughs> Radio X. Ellis James and John Robbins. Coming up next, we've got Humble Brag of the Week, but a few things I've really got to mention uh, based on the fact uh, that we've just tweeted a photo of mine that Wales Online have used uh, to declare that I'm the 36th coolest man in Wales. Uh, Mr Burgess on Twitter, yes, that is my real hair. Um, uh, to Karen Bodrib, that is quite a chin. Yeah, yeah, the the photo is very misleading. I don't I don't look like that anyway. And to Sam Fuller, who just when he saw the photo just texted us lots of swear words. Yeah, fair enough. That is also what I think uh, about the photo. But um, and anyway. to Mick in Eton, you can't technically get any time back. Uh, it's not specifically time you spent watching Ellis's new sitcom that you can't get back. It's, it's all time. Thanks, John. Are you in a bad mood because you're hungover? Yes. Because yeah. you're being very mean. But that was because, very funny but because I'm because I'm like <laughs> Teflon, I don't mind. Yes, Mick. Time is linear, so you you, you, you took your chance. Yeah. You gambled, you threw the dice, and it didn't come off, in your opinion. I am very proud of it, personally, but Mick and Eaton... Turn, I was going to say, turn your radio off. No, don't. No, no, Keep, we need the figures. Yes, all right, Dave. Stop having a go at me Sorry. off air because of the figures. Radio X. Also, I really need to uh, to reference this to Jake Rhodes, who's seen the photo um, that Radio X have tweeted of me, uh, who's um, uh, made the point that I'm rocking a Noel Gallagher monobrow. That's fine, but now that is treated by the good people at Tony and Guy. <laughs> so don't worry, those days are long gone. Yeah, we've got now the arrogance. One Justin uh, Ellis to the uh, to the uh, the the email. Humble brag of the week, Ellis James, quote, I hate that picture of me, and the press have used it about 5,000 <laughs> times. <laughs> no! Yes. Apologies yes. for that. that. <laughs> what? Is that a little sweary swear? No, I didn't. I didn't. Well, we'll listen to that back. Uh, but uh, Ellis James there, humble brag of the week.